My book is all about how to grow incredible, exciting gourmet food for a whole new generation. Once upon a time, growing your own is all about turnips, spuds, sprouts, swede, like growing 1940s ingredients that people just don't eat anymore. And people just don't realize you can grow everything from bamboo shoots to saffron to tiny little cocktail kiwis to uh, things that taste like cinnamon to artificial colors and artificial flavors that are, of course, entirely natural from plants, uh, all in your own back garden, and they're easier than growing a turnip. The book is basically based on a hundred plants that I've tested out in my back garden, so I've proven that they are easier, they are uh, more productive, and they do taste better than everything you grow at home. And it's categorized onto a whole range of things. So not only do you have um, ingredients like fruit and veg, you have herbs, you have spices, which most people think you can't grow in the UK, and you have artificial colors, flavors, and all kinds of ingredients. And each of those comes with um, information on how to grow them, but also how to cook and use them. Um, and in certain situations, they have multiple uses. So they may have a medicinal use, they may have a flavor, like a, a nutritional use, but they may have something a little bit fun as well. There's, there's a particular plant in there you can make into candy, you pop it in your mouth, it's called wintergreen, and when you crunch down on it, a blue flash of light sparks out your mouth. So totally different from your muddy boots digging, digging a trench allotment book. There's no point in, in growing things that are widely available and cheap to buy, but there is a huge amount of point in growing weird, wonderful gourmet crops that you would love to get hold of, but in some senses you can't even buy them, and the only way to get them is to grow your own. This isn't a book for gardeners. This is a book for people who love food, and gardening is the only way you can get hold of this amazing stuff.